The long awaited Metro Police body camera program is slowly coming to fruition starting this week. News Channel 5's Matthew Tor shows us how Metro Police are taking this next step. This is the beginning of what many would say is a long overdue venture in Nashville. Starting this week, a team from Texas is in town to help install three cameras inside each Metro Patrol vehicle as part of the police body camera program. Roughly, it will take about uh, uh, three to four hours to complete a car. Last month, Mayor John Cooper announced that Metro Police will start fully deploying the program in July. The city's budget crisis nearly stalled the program again until the vendor agreed to install them now and begin charging the city later. Metro leaders say it will cost $2 million a year at a fraction of the staff. We have been really preparing for this for a long time. We've known it was coming, and so uh, we, we have been ready for a while. IT Director John Singleton says more than 90 West Precinct officers and 65 vehicles will be equipped with the cameras first. The officers are now training on how to use the body cameras, which will work in tandem with the in-car camera system. They'll have to upload the footage from the car using high-speed Wi-Fi. We are installing multiple access points throughout the parking lots uh, at the precincts, designed in such a way that, that would maximize that. This comes after years of skepticism and frustration from community advocates who have wanted the cameras since two high-profile police shootings. In a statement last month, the Community Oversight Board said body and in-car cameras is a step in the right direction but warns it's not the sole solution in fixing systemic problems. It may be starting out in West Precinct first, but the ultimate goal is to equip more than 1,300 Metro officers and more than 700 patrol vehicles by February of next year. Reporting in Nashville, Matthew Torres, News Channel 5. Equipping cameras for the West Precinct could take up to five or six weeks.